No sign of him anywhere. Maybe he lived before we got here? It's a possibility. Again, I suppose so. I guess we should go back for rarer fruit. <laughs> you wanna know what we're funny? I know this is mean, but if that full moon brought out Robert Fruit's spirit found from inside her, he'd smack Fruity upside the head for being so scared. <laughs> <laughs> that is funny. The hell was that? It sounded like rarer fruit. It's getting closer too. Please be the living in here, man! It was so ungodly! Horrifying! Okay, I was just playing with you. Now you're really getting to annoy me with the whole cowardice side of yours. What in the hell is going on? I found Spike. He's certainly not normal. Hold on, you actually found him? Uh huh. Huh. You actually did something right. Well, where is he? Well, I didn't know either! So now who's the Einstein of this here menagerie? Oh, really? I truly did me to scare you. I was expecting you at least spoke of my... yourself. Ew, I'm so scared. A giant pony that's supposed to be a baby dragon. And he still has the hunts for rare fruit. Come on now, I'll give you a taste of my own personal medicine. <gasps> Always has to be. If you want to get something done, you have to do it yourself. All right, big boy. Let's see if you can put the scare in me. Oh, for you, pretty little face. And who might you be? If you insist, my name is Brutalite Sparkcake, leader of the Elements of Insanity. We came here looking for you. For me? You came looking for me? <laughs> well, is it that a surprise? Your name seems highly familiar. You can just call me Ash Spike. Interesting name. But you ought to know me. I am the pony formerly known as Twilight Sparkle. But the little Twily you've known is no more now. Hello? Hello? Any pony home? Is it really you, Twilight? What? I... But you haven't... I only wanted to see Rarity again. But to go through all this just because you have a crush on some pony? I couldn't help it. I just miss you guys. It hurts so much to have you gone that I just had to do it. It's okay. I'm here now. Surprise! Huh? I don't know what just happened, but you're not going anywhere now. Nice time, of Pinkus. As always! Now as for you, aren't you a big ripe pig? <laughs> I always wanted to take a bite and have a taste of dark meat. <laughs> this isn't over, Bruno White! It's only begun. You can barely see me again. I can promise that. It. I was going to attack him, but something just flickered inside of me, like some old memory that's still lingering inside my mind. Spike. What was that, Dewey? <laughs> Nothing you should be concerned about. No one is to attack or even try to commune with that thing. I would handle the situation myself, and that's a direct order. Do I make myself clear? Good. At least you still know how to listen. Now then, I'll be off.